gravel climb here coming up. It's really good. It's called Haven of Bishop, I believe. Um, starts off pretty chill, gets up to like 10, 15% maybe. Uh, really, really nice climb. I'll commentate for a bit of it and then probably just play some music because uh, we don't really hit it that, that hard. So it's not too much to talk about. But yeah, it's a real nice climb. You can see I, I'm taking the inside up this climb. I think it's one way, maybe. But anyway, I'm not really sure. But anyway, you can pretty much take the road. No one really drives down these roads, which is really good. But yeah, it's. It, I'm not sure exactly how technical steep it is, well how steep it is exactly, it's, I think it's probably about 6 or 7%, uh, it's about a good 5 five minute effort I think if you're going absolutely full gas, uh, we were just chilling up this part, but I have gone full gas uh, before, went down actually just over the last 2 minutes and it was a good, good climb, uh, there was no heart rate data today because my chest, I had like, when I crashed, I like had a couple, a couple of cuts on my chest, uh, which is a bit annoying, so I couldn't really put the heart rate monitor on, just helped quite a lot, you can see obviously the gear, gear, this is just shopping because the gears are all wrong, but apart from that, it's, it was a solid climb. You don't really need that much easy gear if you're going full gas. But you can see the road here is um, it's a lot more gravelly than some of the other climbs I've done. It's not as smooth. And around the corners, there's some technical hairpins. There's three hairpins, I believe. Um, and the first one, which we're just coming up to, probably about 20 30 seconds. That is pretty technical, and you have to, you have to make sure that you take it in the right way if you go too if you go too too far like too close and just cut it too fine i don't think you're probably going to get up because you'll just have a lot of wheel spin at the end uh and then after after that i think it should be it generally isn't too technical after that that corner but you just got to watch out for that corner uh, and just take the outside line it's less steep you're not going to get as much tire slip uh, and you should get up it okay um so it's sort of it's not it's not smooth either the, in terms of gradient like the gradient comes around like comes up and down quite a lot it's quite it's quite a hard one just to do even pacing um, just because it gets down sort of three four percent and then here's here comes a really steep steep part of the steep part of the climb just coming up here it ramps up to probably I don't know maybe 12 30 percent uh, which is just like you know it hurts a bit more. I find gravel I can generally put a bit more power out there which is always good I quite like these gravel climbs because they're a bit quieter but you'll see here that Dan's on the inside and he's not really going to get up so he basically has to swerve right so where I was is probably like the ideal line I'd say uh, you want to sort of take the right hand side of the road and you can see here like it's it's a pretty steep one and we sort of get down to sort of six seven k's seven k's an hour and sort of push up um, but apart from that it's a, it's, a, it's, a, it's a cracking climb how to get to this climb uh, you go up old northern summit for probably a kilometer maybe uh, and then turn right and then, uh, that's basically the road that we were on before, and then you take, take a right onto Haven's Bishop, is what it's called, uh, which is pretty beautiful. Nice climb. Uh, it's not much else to say. Um, it's not. I think I wouldn't like to do it in the wet, obviously, but generally it doesn't rain too much in Adelaide, uh, which is nice. The gravel is it's pretty solid, to be honest. The gravel, uh, it's not it's not too uh, loose, which is good. The corners a little bit loose, but yeah. Apart from that. Um, should I, I'll have, I think I'm going to have a KOM attempt at this because it's, it's a nice 5 minute climb. Uh, yeah, apart from that, it's a pretty chill climb, so I go out, do it, see where your PB is. I'd say probably yeah, 5 or 6 minutes would be a good time, um, and I'll see you in the next video.
This is 